Hello everyone, this is the Insert Title Show and I'm your host, Will Strife. In this episode I am going to be talking about God of War, Ghost of Sparta. This was the second one in the series to come out on the PSP. Oddly enough, it came out after God of War 3, I think it was in November. So this was the only God of War game not to come out in uh, March. Kind of weird, but whatever. It might also be my third favorite one in the entire series. Yeah, it's yeah, I'd say it's my third favorite one, surprisingly again. But it's got a really cool story. And, um, the boss fights, I don't really recall being too crazy in this one, but you get to do a lot of crazy shit with Kratos. The plot basically runs around, um, involves, I guess, whatever you want to say, uh, Kratos' long-lost brother. <laughs> so I'll just give you that little nugget to get your attention uh, peaked. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And uh, other than the first one, this is the only one that Ares makes an appearance in, too. So, yeah, a lot of interesting stuff going on in this one. The combat is actually pretty cool. And uh, one really cool aspect is, because uh, this is right after God of War 1, so, spoiler alert, Kratos is now the new God of War. He actually, uh, in this one, goes back to Sparta to kind of go home and see how it's going and stuff. So he picks up the uh, spear and uh, shield of Sparta, and uh, you get to fight as a hoplite, so that's kind of cool. And uh, a, lot of, a lot of other cool stuff. I think uh, I may be mistaken, but I think in this one we get to uh, sink uh, Atlantis, I believe. <laughs> Can't remember. We either did that in uh, Chains of Olympus or we do that in this one. I'm not sure. But yeah, uh, you know, Kratos being Kratos, he sinks the city of Atlantis. Whatever. <laughs> and uh, also, I think in this one, we might get to hang out, so to speak, with uh, King uh, Midas. You know, famous for the Midas touch. Turns everything to gold. So that's kind of cool. That's a uh, really awesome game. And uh, again, like uh, Chains of Olympus, if you want to play it on the PS3, you can. You just have to buy the collector's edition. So, rock on.